This video is for Brandy, who requested some exercises for the core. I have so many um, favorite core exercises, I didn't know exactly which one to choose. So I'm going to go over about six different exercises, and then I'll show you how to mash them all together for a workout. The first exercise that I'm going to show you is going to be a squat and twist. You're going to squat down like you normally squat, and then you're going to bring one leg up, and twist a little to get that extra squeeze through your core. Okay? So you'll squat. The next two exercises that I'm going to show you are going to be from a plank position. So when you're in the plank position, you know it's very important to keep a, a tight core. So I'm in the plank position. My core is nice and tight. You want to make sure that your hips aren't sinking down too low or aren't up too high. You want to keep it nice and in line, okay? All you're going to do is reach for the wall with one hand. When you do this exercise, you want to make sure you're not rotating your hips too much when you reach for the wall. So you don't want to do this. You want to keep your core nice and tight and reach. Our plank jacks. And you can do those from your elbows um, if you need a little variation. So, you're in the plank position and you're going to jump out, jump in, jump out, jump in, jump out, in. You can also do the same exercise from your elbows and it makes it just a little bit easier. So you're on your elbows, nice strong core, out, in. The next exercise is a press up with a knee tuck. And that's gonna work your triceps as well as your core. You're gonna start in a push up position. You're going to drop all the way down to the ground. Press up, knee tuck in. Down all the way to the ground. Press up, knee tuck in. And that is a press up with knee tucks. This next exercise is called a pendulum. So you're gonna put your hands, you're gonna stand with your, first of all, with your legs about shoulder length apart. And you're gonna place your hands on the ground down in front of you. Okay? Push your hips back just a little. And you're going to push side to side with your legs. So the last exercise that I'm going to show you today is uh, crab kicks. And this is going to be from the ground as well. You're going to place your hands facing your feet. Your fingers should be facing your feet. Your arms nice and tight. And of course your core is nice and tight. And you're going to kick up. Okay, so those are the six exercises that I wanted to show you for core today. And there are tons more out there, um, great exercises that you can do to strengthen your core. So I'm going to match them all together for a little workout. We're going to do eight rounds. I wrote it down this time. We're going to do eight rounds of 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. We're going to do the squat twist, plank wall touches with some skipping, plank jacks, crab kicks and then some skipping, and then a press up with knee tucks and the pendulum. So, we're gonna go ahead and set our interval timer. And like I mentioned in my last video, you can 
download this interval timer from the Apple App Store or from the Android App Store and it's a free app. So we're going to change our work time to 20 seconds. Our rest time is 10 and we're going to do eight rounds. And you don't have to just do 20 seconds on and 10 seconds off. You can do 30 seconds on with 10 seconds off. A lot of my workouts are 50 seconds on and 10 seconds off. I try to get in as much work time as I can, um, and that really elevates your heart rate and really pushes the intensity of your workout. Um, so we're going to do eight rounds for four minutes today. Of course, you know, you can time it out to however long you want, uh, 20 minutes, 15 minutes, 12 minutes however long you want your workout to be for the day. But for the sake of demonstration, we're gonna start with the four minutes and we're gonna walk all the way through the workout. So that first round was skipping, 20 seconds. Now we're doing the squat and twist. down my score so the next time I do it I can see how I improved. So plank wall touches. Plank jacks. We hammered out sixteen of those that round. Four crab kicks. knee tuck. Thank you. 
So those are some great workouts for your core and I hope that you like them and I hope they help you with what you need at this time in your workout. So I'll see you guys next time. Peace.